What's up, Fruiters? I'm Old McMillan, and welcome to Night Blights, the game. I'm not quite sure who made this game, but I'll put a link to the game on Steam below, because it, lo it looks like a pretty fun game, and if you guys want to check it out, that's where it is in the description below. <laughs> anyway, um, <laughs> I don't know what I'm saying. Um, I tried to record this originally, I tried to record this before, and didn't really go too well. By that I mean I closed something, and then the entire game just crashed. So, this is the second attempt, but I didn't get that far, and I just walked around for me a few seconds. But anyway! Enough talking about my failures. <laughs> Wait, hold up. There's a thing. Never mind. I'm I'm just gonna stop talking, let's get into the game. So, Night Flights by Gary Bunn. Controls, left click, okay, use the look. Okay, got it. As down it, as, <clears throat> as down goes the sun and up comes the moon, a terror from the dark is coming, and soon they hide in the shadows and strike something quick, something mischievous that likes a good trick. <clears throat> you've, you've one simple goal, so try to have fun. Just survive until morning and the rise of the sun. Uh, safe in your bed, same may seem. Close hand, you make a noise, feed them quick to one of your toys when they. Oh, that's a cute little octopus. Anyway, uh, that's, uh, so that's the thing. So pretty much, if you guys if you guys don't really know how, like what this game's about, is you're kind of a little kid, you're just chilling your home. Then there's these little night flight dudes, and they're gonna like come eat your family and stuff. So you gotta feed them your toys and stuff and survive. It's no, it's kind of like Five Nights at Freddy's. You gotta survive until morning, which is a, I I like those kind of concepts. They're they're really cool. Anyway, let's go on to this. There's a night blight under your parents' bed. Oh no, feed it toys like this when it growls. Is that Furby? I saw Furby. There's also a night blight downstairs under your sister's bed. Okay, night blights like to hide inside fridges and wardrobes. Pineapple! Sponsor Pineapple, what are you doing with that night blight, you silly? If they get out, your night will become much harder. Okay. Uh. So, waiting for me to play the game. There are four wardrobes around the house. Anyway, I know my animals. Dinosaur. Ah! Okay, I'm sorry, I'm panicking. I gotta feed. I have to give, like, I have to sacrifice all my toys to some demons before they eat me. Here you go, bud. Just don't hurt me. Just eat my toy, okay? Yummy, yummy. <laughs> yummy, yummy. Okay, let's grab this Furby real quick. Eh. Come over here. Knife blade in the fridge is trying to get out. Go in the kitchen, stop it. Hey, hey you. What are you doing? Mm-hmm. Wait, right. hey, get back in the fridge, you silly. I never I never said you come out. Okay, the game almost crashed there. Oh. Oh, that could have been bad. Um, okay. So it looks like there's only those three for now, so I just need to like keep them fed. And then they won't hurt me, I think. Right, oh right, there's also wardrobes, I forgot about that. I'm stuck, I'm stuck in the bars! That always happens when I play games. I just get stuck in the walls and stuff. Okay, what about this wardrobe? Uh, it's closed. This wardrobe is already closed, okay. Thanks for letting me know, bud. Uh, one sec, I gotta change some stuff. Really quickly. Cut this. <laughs> Got it! and sensitivity a little bit. Uh, now it's really jittery. Oh, 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 no, 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 you're not gonna go. This is way too high. One sec. <laughs> Got it! Cut it again! That's still worse, whatever. Mm. I need a tasty high sensitivity, or a tasty low sensitivity. I don't know what I'm saying anymore. Uh, hello? Wardrobe? That's a, that's a clock. Nice job, Matt. Um, what, alright, there's a wardrobe over here. Oh! Oh, you almost got out. Okay. So there's another Furby. So one of them said feed me, so I think that's, I should probably feed him. You know? Hello? Okay. There's no knife blade under there. I hear creaking. I hear creaking. What's going on in here? Oh, hello. <laughs> But don't come at me! 
You almost got it. Ooh, ooh, okay. Okay, I'll feed you. Calm down. I need to find a toy. Oh, phone. Get me out of here. No one is available to take your call. No. Please leave a message. Help, Bob. I'm being murderized by evil Davis babies in my fridge. Okay, thanks, thanks, Mom. This game's really scary, and I don't really know what to do. I'm gonna run, I'm gonna start to run out of toys and have to do some sweet parkour tricks soon. Uh, um, okay. I'm gonna check the wardrobes upstairs. Let's see, okay, that one's closed. Uh, okay, this, there's a knife laying right here. Eat my toy, please, thank you. Yum, yum. Okay, no, you're staying there. There's nothing, oh, I think it's almost morning, I can see the light. And I like, oh, okay, I can bring. Okay, I'll feed you. Calm down. Lots of hungry people. Oh, kind of like, okay, there's a toy up there, so I can eh, put my stool right there, and then just. Eh. Okay, I'm sorry, Furby number two, but you're gonna have to be fed. Your eyes, oh, you're so pretty. I, I don't want to feed you to them. I'll feed you, okay? I'm assuming it's the dude over here. No, it's not. Wait, is it the guy in the fridge? Or does that count as a wardrobe and I don't have to feed him? Oh, wardrobe. Fr wardrobe fridge thing is almost open. Just probably close that. Stand there! You're not getting out. Are you laughing at me? Stop laughing at me, you silly. Ugh, this game is really intense. I don't really. <laughs> Such an. Okay, the plate upstairs in your parents' bed is the better toy. <laughs> yum, yum. So who, wrote, who writes time to die to like a little kid? These are some really demon things. Ooh, can I? Okay, no, I can't. That'd be, that would probably scare me more. Time to die. Time to not. Ha! <laughs> Come back, Central. Hello? Pretty creek. I have a dinosaur and I will feed him to you. Oh no. Oh no. That was not the creek thing. Wardrobe upstairs. Hallway. Needs to be shut. Mm. Okay, it's that one. I know which one. Time to die. No. Oh, that was almost open. Closet. Closet. Yeah. Yes. I'm gonna save my parents. I'm gonna save the night. They won't know what hit them. I'm gonna put that thing right there. The blight, the. Ah. No, I'm gonna leave that one. I'm gonna leave this one here. I can grab. I saw a green dinosaur downstairs. I can feed them that instead. And then, if the one upstairs needs to be fed, let's feed them that other one. Yeah. My parents are gonna be wondering where all my toys went after all this. And I'll just say, The demons under the bed ate them. And then I'll just, like, get yeah, from outside. Yeah, yes, that. My parents are very strict. Anyway, uh, so it looks like I more or less got this under control for us. Um, so, except we're just gonna start running out of toys soon that are easily reachable, which will be bad. And I'm not. There's no timer, so it doesn't tell me how much more time I got left. Does this clock work? No, it's a fake clock. It lied to me. It's lies! Anyway, let's just... Okay, you're coming with me, stool. We're gonna go on an adventure. Close that closet. There we go. Okay, um, does that clock work? It's, I think it says it's like 5 a.m. or something. I think you gotta survive until about 7. So, this might be... So, it's like two more hours. See? I'll feed you, calm down! You don't need to start hurling like death threats and stuff against the shop. <laughs> oh, I think that one almost got out. That could have been bad. Ugh. Ugh, this is so scary! I hate it! And I, yeah, I love it so much. Ugh. Like I always say, it scares so good. 
Okay, um, I did hear a wardrobe, so I'm assuming that's one upstairs, probably. Uh, oh, cause, yeah, that clock does work. It's almost, it's like half past five. So we just got, just... Oh, what was that? I just, it, there was a wardrobe there? I didn't know that. I didn't know there was a wardrobe there. <laughs> okay, so I did read that it said, um, it makes, like, if a nightlight gets out or something, and I get assuming that's what just happened. It makes the game much more harder and more difficult to control. More difficult to manage. So I think that one got out, which means that it's gonna be a whole lot more difficult to play this game now. Fridge downstairs in the kitchen. It's been shut. Parkour baby. Dang it, I missed. Just get the stall get out of my way, I'm gonna die. And close this fridge really quick. Stay in there with Sponsor Pineapple. Sponsor Pineapple, save him. Yeah. I think I saw some Cheerios in there. I need a snack break. For all this running around, feeding all my toys to demons and stuff. Okay, I think that might actually be the last toy, which is kind of worrying. Considering I don't see where any more could be. Blight, under your sister's bed, you fed a toy. Okay, I'll feed it right after I get this thing. Frame rate is dropping. This is, this could be bad. Uh, oh, the school doesn't flip. I can't get that last toy. Come on. It's right there. I can't. I'm running out of toys. I need to, I think that it's the last. Oh, the chain. Okay, money complete. <laughs> and free, and free play mode unlocked. Okay, let's proceed to continue really quick. Uh, does that just go to the menu or does that continue on to the next night? Okay, there we go. Tuesday. Night flights are a danger only children can see. And the taste of small babies, it fills them with glee. When they come near, a baby shall cry. Spin the oval swiftly, else baby will die. Well then! I, this game just got pretty dark pretty quickly. If the garage door opens and breathing you hear, then surely you know that a night flight is near. So press the red button and keep the door shut tight. This will keep this will help keep you safe. <laughs> help keep you safe throughout the long night. I actually really like the concept of this game because like you're kind of like a kid, and like I knew that when I was a kid I was like scared of pretty much everything, like monsters in my bed. Which is in a closet. I don't know why I thought that was a thing. Anyway, this actually, like, like I said, is actually a pretty cool concept on like how this game was built around. So like, like it's pretty much like some kind of management thing where you have to kind of assemble a bunch of things and get them out in time. And if you don't get them out in time, then bad things will happen. In this position, I will be murderized. But thank you everybody so much for watching this video. If you enjoyed it, please spam the crap. Oh, that like button to let me know if you guys want to see more of this game, and I'll see you in the next one. Bye-bye.